Anthony Cardinal Okoje Foundation, ACOF, the story. The main hope of a nation, it is said, lies in the proper education of its youth. We live in a permissive society of moral and spiritual laxity and financial imbalance. What can we do to break the cycle of poverty in our beloved country, Nigeria? In keeping with our goal of awarding scholarships to outstanding indigent students, the Anthony Cardinal Okoje Foundation is a foundation for the future. The foundation provides access to quality education and training to create good grassroots movements. This foundation gives dedicated students who are passionate about learning and development the opportunity and resources to turn their aspirations into reality. When we were proclaimed cardinal by Pope Saint John Paul II in the consistory of the 21st of October 2003, there were lots of celebration, as you will expect, and among the activities was the suggestion that it would be good if we marked this up with a, a foundation. And it was well accepted, well applauded. The foundation gives avenue to quality education. It is accessible even to the poorest of the poor children in our midst, in our society. And of course, to help the hopeless cases. The foundation is unique in the sense of the fact that it focuses its energy and its resources on generating funds that will help children who are from indigent homes to achieve and attain education, knowing fully well that education is a gift that will help to lift a child from from the state of poverty, which may have, uh, uh, he may have experienced in the family, give him a chance for the future so that he can rise above the situation of the, of the, of the moment when as he, is a, he or she is a child. This is a scholarship that is meant for Nigerians anywhere in the world where they are. And the objective is to train a whole generation of young people, male and female, at every level of education to develop Nigeria, all paid for from very generous donations of uh, Nigerians to the Anthony Cardinal Okoje Foundation. The Archbishop uh, appointed a number of members working with us, and we also in order to be able to carry it out effectively, have a number of very good people selected to help us in the interview and the selection of those who qualify for the scholarship. We have been given a free hand. Scholarship is awarded even to people who are yet in secondary schools, people in the universities, and people who are doing uh, studies that we think are worthy of support. The idea of this foundation is one that has tried to capture the vision and the character of he whom we are celebrating every time we gather, Anthony Cardinal Okoji, uh, in the sense that he was a man of the people, he was a man of God in the real sense of the word, a man of God. He served God and he served humanity so much so that even in his retirement, we have not allowed him to rest and we continually bring up this annual event to ensure that his legacy continues to live on and uh, humanity continues to benefit from this uh, enigmatic character, I want to say, uh, given to us as a gift by God himself. And so what has Anthony Cardinal Okoje Foundation been to me, I would say is a gift of God to man and more so to those who are indigent and are able to smile once again knowing that even in the difficult situation that surrounds our nation at this moment at least there are still some characters out there who still have a way of putting smile on people's face. So I'll say congratulations to the planners, 
Congratulations to the director of the Lay Apostolate Center, Reverend Father Hyacinth Ibe, and uh, of course, most congratulatory of all to the character who has gathered us together, Anthony Cardinal Okoje. You see, if you go to the villages outside Lagos, and people hear of Lagos, there is this erroneous notion that, oh, Lagos is a land flowing with milk and honey. But this foundation has opened my eyes to the problems of Lagosians and the fact that there are so many poor people in Lagos. You can imagine people living in Lagos and elsewhere in the country who can't even afford three square meals. You can imagine people attending educational institution where the school fees is just as little I say as little as 5,000 per year and parents can't afford that. I've been known him for a very long time. I know a few things that are very dear to his heart. One of them is education. He cares very much about education of the young particularly and uh, you can see that in the number of schools, institutions that he has created all over Lagos such diocese. Any Nigerian who is studying, who has good brains and is ready to work hard can benefit from the scholarship. There is no discrimination. We give award to people who are still in secondary school, people who are in universities, colleges of education, no matter where. All you have to do is apply, complete your form, you have to sub give us all the information we need to be sure that you are genuinely uh, studying and you need a scholarship and you are doing very well. Scholarships are not distributed to people who are not doing well. You have to do well so that the benefit of what you gain from the scholarship will spread to other people for generations to come. Anthony Cardinal Okoji Annual Lecture and Fundraising is an initiative that offers ambassadors and sponsors the opportunity to support this lasting endowment. For 12 years, the Foundation has been building and sharing human capital to change attitude, lives and ultimately our world. Initially, we are sponsoring our beneficiaries 100%. But because of the demands, as we said, the demands are getting more, yet the resources are getting dwindled. Surprisingly, this year we got five, over 500 applications. Over 500. So you can imagine the problem we have to go through to screen and screen and screen. Because we don't have money to sponsor all these 500. So eventually we screened them down to 35. And the 35, I bet you, is going to really cost us a lot. It's costing us a lot. And that is why we appeal to these benefactors, those who give, to really not relent. Brothers and sisters, friends and well-wishers, you have done well. Without you, we could not have come this far, but there is still much to be done. This is a defining moment in the realization of our goals and we appeal to you to continue to keep faith with us. Any individual can be a sponsor. No amount is too small for this kind of game because we're only trying to help humanity. The poor to be, I think, to know that where the, the state where they find themselves is not where God wants them to be. What is only putting them behind it's someone to lift them up. Thank you that uh, you have identified with the vision and the mission of uh, the Anthony Cardinal Lulubemi Okoje Foundation. Continue and not step back in giving in order to not only honor the Cardinal, but also give a value to the lives of the children concerned, the lives of their families, and the life of the nation. We use this opportunity to plead with all Nigerians to donate money towards the foundation. Nobody serving on the foundation receives one cobble uh, as uh, 
member of the board. We all give our free service and the Archbishop encourages us every time because we have to make a periodic report to him of what we have done and the scholarships we have awarded. Unfortunately, he has never turned down any of the recommendations we have made. Even when we thought we've given out a little more scholarship than uh, we should have, he's managed to help us uh, keep it rolling and our duty is to make sure that we reach out to as many Nigerians as possible. But I, I want to plead and beg, never be tired. This is a worthy project. I want to crave your indulgence and plead that our sponsors should not look back, should not even have a rethink because this project is one that the world is looking for. Remember that if you think education is expensive, as they say, try ignorance. And what has ignorance brought to us? Death disaster, violence. Imagine what Nigeria could be if we are one true family. With your support, we can get there. Please do not renege, do not say no. Anthony Cardinal Okoje Foundation is out there to put a smile on someone's face with your help. I wish to say a very big thank you to the sponsors of this foundation. I'm grateful for all what they've done. They have been on scholarship since GS3. Since GS3, I've never, I've not had any problem of my school fees. They are calling me out. My, my name has always been part of the, um, the debtors, but my name has not been there since GS3 because they, they always make sure that this, that the school fees and other expenses of the school are paid promptly. So I don't have any problem again thinking, unlike before not in GS1 and GS2, of thinking of how my parents are going to pay for the school fees when they are going to pay. It's because they always pay when my name is called out as a debtor. But no, I don't have any problem with that. Thanks to this foundation. I don't know how to appreciate them, but I know that God is, is going to replenish their pocket and bless them. Please do not give up now. Reach deep into your hearts and deep into your pockets and donate generously to the future of our children. Thank you and God bless you all.